Hey everybody, happy Friday. Please excuse my voice. I am still uh, trying to get over this mess that I have. <coughs> excuse me. Oh, goodness. Um, let's see here. Okay. How would you like to all make some quick and easy inserts for your journals to help decorate? And whew, Christmas is on its way. It's right around the corner. So what I did was make these, these out of six by six uh, Christmas paper. This one out of eight by eight. And this one out of 12 by 12. So these would be great for uh, journal inserts to send your friends uh, for happy mail or racks or whatever you would like to use them for. Um, I today am, well, first let me show you what's on the inside. So I have this little six by six piece here that turned into a three by three. So you open it up and I have a picture here. You open it like this and I have a little pocket with a little tag. And then you open this side and it opens all the way out. And I left this, I stenciled this a little bit, but I left it all for journal space. So this closes this way, this goes up this way, and this closes for the front. So there you have it. Quick, easy, and very, very um, uh nice to add for journaling space and a uh, little decoration in your journal. And um, what I have been doing like for this one is using my scrap pieces. And this had uh, like a fold on this part right here. So I just added a little washi tape to cover up the little fold that was there. And I think that looks just great for journaling space. So there's that one. And then we have the 12 by 12, which we're going to make today. <clears throat> and this one opens up like this. I have a picture here. And this one I didn't, um, stencil. I just left it for journaling space. We have a pocket here with a tag and this opens up like this and then you have all this journaling space. So let's get started. I'm going to set these aside. These are very simple, quick and easy. Um, I am going to make the 12 by 12 this time. So I'm going to get out my board um, with the smaller ones I just folded them but um, where this is 12 by 12 I think I'm going to score it first just to be on the safe side if I can find my little scoring tool so we are going to score this at six turn once and score at six that's all you need to do Get rid of my board. <clears throat> and then we are just going to fold. <sighs> fold on this line. And then we're going to fold on this line. got my bone folder right in my hand and I'm using my fingers and then we are going to fold into the square hope you all are having a great day I did get tested yesterday so I know it's not COVID 
done. So Thanksgiving is on for us with the children coming, or I should say the kids coming from Vermont. I am just going to just cut this a little bit right here. Just give it a little trim. Not that you probably need to, but. And then while I have it folded like this, I am going to round the corners. Hope you all are ready for Thanksgiving. Having lots of family and friends. Okay, so I'm rounding the corners. Or I did round the corners, sorry. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh my goodness. Enough to scare anybody away. Um, okay, so as you can see, we have it like this now. And what we are going to do is choose one of our score lines and we are going to cut right up to the middle score line, just like that. So there you have your cut. So if we fold like this in, then up, and then over, we have our cover. Okay. So for the cover, I decided to place this gorgeous little snowman right here. And I'm gonna round these corners on this side using my quarter, my quarter inch. Oops. Well, goodness, I didn't wanna I didn't want to cut too well. I hope it's not getting um, dull already. Okay, so I am going to glue this right here and hopefully can find something to put right in this area. I'm using my art glitter glue and I'm going to glue this right down. Yeah, it was an eventful day yesterday. I had a, uh, went and had a rapid test for flu and COVID. And I was told I would be called at five o'clock before they, uh, see the test takes, takes like 15 minutes. And I was told they would call me about five. And five came around, no call. Six came around, no call. So I said, that's some kind of rapid testing that is. So regardless, I didn't get, well, I called them first thing this morning. So, so much for rapid testing. Um, let's see. I know I want to put a pocket, so let's go inside here. Um... Uh, I think I will put a pocket here and I have a little pocket all set to go right here. So I'm going to put this down. Got my stuff cut out ahead of time and you'll notice that if you do your homework and get everything cut out ahead of time, it goes much faster for when you go to put these little things together. I'm just going to put this right down here for a pocket. Okay. And let's see. What do I want to put here? I usually put just a picture here. I have this cute little, I think I'll put him, cute little snowball. <clears throat> I'll put him down there for just a picture. <sighs> OK, 
goodness. That's what's wrong with my art glitter glue. I'm sorry if I'm off camera. That's what's wrong. My little uh, peak is, my little pointer is missing. Okay, so let me get this down. I was thinking about putting something underneath it, which I probably should, but I don't have anything right here available to slap underneath that. Maybe uh, let's see. I don't think I'll be able to find anything in my stash here. I'm sorry. Just take me a second, I think. No, I don't see anything offhand, but I am going to just put this down right here, about right in the middle. I normally would probably take the time to find something to, you know, put underneath it, but um, I didn't have anything ready and I didn't want to make you... <coughs> make you guys wait for such a thing so this is down and let's see what else have we got here no <sighs> like the little bunnies. Let me cut out the little bunnies real quick. Just a fast, fast little cut here. These are so adorable. I just love the little, the little bunnies. Sorry, I should have had these things all cut out, but I just have not been feeling like doing much of anything. But I want these, I think, to lay right about there. So, you guys are all ready for Thanksgiving, I would assume. I hope you're all going to have some family members and some friends and have a good, a good gathering because I think we all need it. We all need a nice, friendly gathering. Them right about there. And then I have the pocket here, so maybe one of these could go in there. <laughs> I would put one of these in here, but it's a little bulky. So what I try to do is keep things nice and um, uh, flat for these little uh, enclosures, so I try not to get too bulky with with these things. I'll put a little tag in there. And maybe a little something right here. Might have some color, but I don't see anything offhand here. Thought I had some things already cut out. But you know how that goes. So, 
I think my granddaughter is on her way to North Carolina to see her grandparents down there. They're going for a quick visit before my um, daughter-in-law, my daughter-in-law's dad has found out he's had, he has prostate cancer and, and then he found out that it has metastasized to his bones and oh, all kinds of different places. So she is going down to visit until, um, I mean, before he has, um, before he starts his chemotherapy, he's going to, um, start next week chemo. So she wants to see him before she, before he starts. I'll put that right about there. And then I'm going to put something in the middle. That might be a little bulky. So let's put this. Oh, goodness. It ever seem like when you're feeling yucky, everything seems to everything seems to give you trouble. Okay, so I've got the little flower and the Christmas here, the little tag, and hopefully that's not going to be too bulky because I did tell you not to get too bulky. So we will flip this up, and that is fine. Flip that over. And now I need a little something up here. Wonder if Santa could be going, but it looks kind of too close to the actual picture. So I am just going to find something else. You know, I told you guys this was quick and easy. Well, it is, I promise, if you have everything all, um, you know, all together so you have everything ready to go. But let's see what this has. I like that. Let's cut this out real quick. Just a little saying to put on here. Oh, goodness. Sorry if I'm off screen. I'm trying to um, do this quickly and unevenly. probably too big, but I can cut it down. Or I can just let it hang over like that. Okay, Christmas time is the day that holds all time together. I love that. That is awesome. Okay, I am going to put this right up here. It's going to hang just a little bit, but that doesn't bother me at all. Okay, and then what I would do, of course, is go ahead and distress everything like I did for this one. 
distress distress all around so we could uh so we can uh leave that as it is and i am looking for a tie of some kind but i don't have anything that goes of course with the coloring So, I guess I can use something like this to tie it together. I am running out of everything and I'm trying so hard not to purchase, um, you know, purchase things because I'm trying to save money for Christmas. So anyway, I would get something, of course, that has a little red or something in it to go with that. So there you go. Quick and easy. If you have all your parts to put in, let me put the glue on here. And um, <clears throat> you guys make some of these for your journals or for a happy mail. They're fun and easy to make. And I hope you guys have a wonderful Thanksgiving holiday. Stay safe. Stay away from this mess that I have, whatever it is, because it's not the flu and it's not COVID. So you guys stay safe, stay healthy, and have a great, great Thanksgiving. And of course, as always, happy crafting. Bye-bye.